do it again! Whee! One more time! Whee! That was pretty rare to see two purple bubbles in the same level like that. I, I think that's pretty rare to see. Kobe! <laughs> yeah, the whole Kobe meme is not referencing this, mind you. It's uh, referencing this famous basketball player named Kobe something. I don't know what's up. I don't know what's funny, but you know. They do, the people do the whole Kobe thing. And they do like an epic shot or something like that. Ah! Or similar to YOLO. Oh my gosh. Oh my, no, no, no! There are two tanks here too? Are you kidding me? Ah! I guess I should have saved that other purple bubble, huh? Oh no, 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 no! I don't want to lose my life. Even though I can afford to lose my life at this point, I still don't want to lose. I am determined to make it through this town alive! I'm determined to make it through the game alive! <laughs> well, I'm out of, I guess I'm out of danger now. Well, <laughs> actually, no, that's wrong to say. Another purple bubble! Seriously! See, this is uh, this piece of meat. Oh, pfft. that's not meat. That those are okay. Looking at it closer, those are boxing gloves. <laughs> okay, that would make more sense. Sapporo, Japan. I haven't even heard of all, all these other towns in Japan, but I guess they exist. Ah! You... train Correct! You guys are going down! Yeah, I... I in all my games, I always have a lot of frame instability. I can manage to achieve 60 FPS, but I can never... I can't fix the stuttering. Why not? I can never find out why. Yeah, do you guys know you could do this? <laughs> yeah, did, uh, did, did you, Andrew and, and Kelly, did you know that you could do that? Stomp on the top like that? Moving on, Sendai, and there's the boxing gloves, which I really thought that was like a piece of meat. Oh no, 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 oh no, that was, I saw that, there were two tanks right there. Oh, good thing I caught that. <sighs> Two tanks right next to each other. Good thing I saw that, because if I... If I let them hit me, then I won't be able to get back up. I would've... I, they would've kept hammering me until I lost all my lives. Right there. Yeah. So how do you deal with two tanks attacking you at the same time? That I'd like to know. Oh yeah! Kick and stomp! Oh no, I let them, I let them get away. Okay, oh uh, come on. Fall out of the building, fall, fall out, fall out! Oh my gosh. No, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get 20 this time. Well, not that I really need to. Yeah, I didn't get 20, but... Oh, wow! I have 12 spare lives now. 
So a total of 13. Since, like I mentioned. Yeah, I, I know about Osaka and Tokyo, Japan. Wait, Tokyo, uh, the Asia, the Asia segment has Lizzie, which is based on Godzilla. Uh, Lizzie should be here. Oh no! Oh no! No! No way! Not happening! Two freaking tanks? Uh-uh. Don't think so. Huh. Yeah. I had to use my power right away. There's no other choice. Well, I'm gonna keep that building around because I'll save that green bubble. Yeah, that kilogram weight, that's the super punch icon as well. Yeah, Lizzie! She's here. Yeah, once I complete all three uh, continent segments, then I'll show you guys what happens next. There's still a lot of levels to come after it, after this. And yeah, <laughs> I'd take out the train just because. Oh well, I guess I didn't really need to use that, but uh. Wait, what? Okay, apparently there's still another building to take out. What? Where? Yeah, see, it won't let you. It won't let you punch that cage unless you take out all the other buildings first. All right. Special reports: Scum Land monsters have struck yet another blow to the world's defenses. Upon destroying Tokyo, they have rescued Lizzie. She, yep, she has joined them now in leveling the rest of the world cities. There's been a terrible new development in our planet's predicament. An alien invasion! See, yep, this is, this is the big surprise I was waiting to tell you guys. The aliens th seem to be unstoppable. Scum Lab monsters appear to be... Yeah, so like now, now we're entering the segment where I take on the aliens. And you know... <laughs> They say the alien monsters seem to be indestructible, huh? But these guys are actually a bunch of pushovers. <laughs> the humans gave me a hell of a lot tr more trouble than than the aliens ever did. <laughs> yeah, for for one thing, it's a it's a lot easier to predict the pattern of this air aircraft than the helicopter. And two, I don't have to deal with any tanks. Three, their attacks hardly hurt me at all. Maybe they, they barely hurt the, the monster at all. Yeah, <laughs> flap away. So all those, all that's, all the bullets are green for some reason. Yeah, you see that the alien, the humans managed to deal more damage to me than that. Oh crap! Air, the air force. Okay, Delhi totally destroyed it. Wait, where is Delhi? Well, I guess we'll see. Save game. Ah, oh, now we're entering Australia. So Delhi was uh, somewhere in Africa, seems like. A cheesecake. 
And a Sunday. Well, I guess eating food—I guess eating food when you're already full does not help your pu your purple meter out. You can only help out the purple meter by getting or by by eating humans or getting the purple bubble. So, well, I don't really need my. I don't really need my uh, special ability anymore, since now the human segment is over. I don't have to deal with any more tanks. <laughs> A boxing glove. Oh, bam, bam. Wah, 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 wah. Oh, what? oh no, I missed the purple bubble. Well, yeah, see, there are some humans present. But that's because the aliens just invaded. But all the but all the attack vehicles now are operated by the aliens. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ah. Trying to, trying to get that. There we go. Oh, that was a lucky break. I got the green bubble to max out my health after that incident. <laughs> yeah, that certainly was lucky of me right there. Hey, what? Hey, hey, what the? Oh my gosh, what the heck? My controller. Wow, that's, that's not good. My uh, uh, my controller was not responding at all when I was punching the, the the punch button. That's not. Oh my gosh! No, not the kick button too. Okay, well this is gonna be difficult now with, with my with my range of motion being very limited. Now it would be hard to beat the aliens, wouldn't it? Supposedly the Le scum lab monsters are are helping helping the people uh, saving the people from the aliens while destroying the rest of the cities in the world at the same time. That doesn't make that doesn't really really make any sense to me. Is are the scum lab monsters saving us or aiding the aliens in destroying the world? <laughs> Oh, rocket launcher. Now I'll eat you up. Hey, you still you can still eat people and destroy their buildings along the way. So it really seems like I'm helping the aliens um, on their um, conquer Earth mission. Well, uh. <laughs> Since I can beat up the aliens too, I'm not exactly siding with the people. I'm not siding with the aliens. I just do whatever the hell I want to do. Ain't nobody can stop me too. <laughs> That's basically it. Sydney, Australia. Now he's swimming across the ocean to Hawaii. Honolulu, Hawaii. Yes. Oh, there's an alien building right there. See, it looks like the aliens have stuck around the world long enough to, uh, to start building their own buildings. Trying to make the Earth their home, huh? Not on my watch. Well, bam! Eh, I guess I better eat that too. Because I don't want the alien air force to come. Yeah, whether it be the human air force or the alien air force, when they when they drop their bombs, they used to lose half your health, so which is very bad. Get rid of that spider bot. 
and this probe. Yeah, see, the aliens are complete pushovers. The tanks still stick around. The tanks will stay. When you're attacking the tanks, they'll stay in that position and won't stop firing at you. So at the same time, you're getting damaged. But if you go straight for the, if you go straight for the alien spider bots, they run away without shooting you, which means you get damaged a whole lot less. <laughs> see that? This is what I mean when I say the aliens are major pushovers. <laughs> Even in hard difficulty, these guys are easy to beat. Destroy the building before your timer runs out. I don't know if I can this time, with my controller being this bad. I sure hope I don't have to replace this controller. I want to keep it. I want to keep all my controllers as long as I can and not have to keep spending money to buy new ones. See, I used to have a red controller, but it broke. And then I used to have another black controller. That one broke. So I had to end up getting a second black controller and then, then I got a blue controller. So I, I'm, I'm really tired of having to switch out my controllers all the time. It just seems like I'm not being too rough with them. They're just not built to last. Okay, Central America. Mexico City. <laughs> yeah. Where is he? There he- Oh, yeah, I was right there. I was exactly in the elevated place. Okay, well, I can't- I guess I- Yeah! Well, it's, it's pretty hard to get them like this, isn't it? I can get him easier like that. Um, I can get him. I can get him. There we go. Well, I lost half of my health trying to get that stupid aircraft carrier. But you know, I guess. Well, since these guys don't damage me very much, it was worth it still. <laughs> Maybe, yeah, maybe the, maybe the aircraft carrier dropping their bombs deal a significant amount of damage. And it can be pretty hard to dodge. So, uh... Yeah, I had to get rid of it first. And another drumstick. Yeah, they just run away and they don't they don't fight you while they're backing off. <laughs> yeah, you know what? <laughs> yeah, another thing I noticed too is that there are, there are not as many bullets shooting all over in the air as well. Yeah, there are not as many random bullets shooting in various places in the alien segment. Uh oh. Uh oh, I gotta finish this. I gotta finish up here quick before the Air Force comes drops their bombs. Okay, good. Now Mexico City was apparently a big place. And moving on. The Caribbean, I guess. I don't really know for sure. So yeah, um, the Scumland monsters are not headed anywhere in particular, as it would seem. But yeah, I don't think, as, as far as I can remember, all the many levels that I come across in Rampage 2, I don't think my town, I don't think my city was ever listed here, so uh... They're, they're probably listing all the the main. All, they're probably listing all the capitals of the cities all over the world. 
Zodiac example, uh, the capital, the capital city of Utah, at the beginning of the game, is uh, Salt Lake City. That's the capital. So I don't think they're going for every single city all over the world. That would just be too damn long to finish the game at that point, wouldn't it? They couldn't fit that much data in an N64 game. This is another alien building we gotta take down. Well, I'm actually running low on health, huh? Maybe a oh yeah. I guess, I guess what, what kind of would make the alien segment more difficult is that there's less food around. Yeah, there's less food to go around in the alien segment. But you know what? Depend... Um, considering how much easier the aliens are to beat than the humans are, and the, the, the food and city defenses ratio, yeah, you would think it would kind of average out. However, yeah, the aliens are just a lot easier to deal with. In general, still. Moving on. Now we're making our way through South America. So, uh, I wonder... What would be a good stopping point for this part of the game? After I get, after I take out all the capitals in the, in all the remaining city capitals in the world, I wonder what would happen after, or where's a good stopping point there? And I guess I'll probably take a note of it. Maybe this, maybe this alien segment is the longest one, I don't know. And you can't exactly get to the alien segment like you can the when you when you start out the game. You can't exactly get to this the same way. Oh shoot! What the heck? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! How did I get dealt so much damage? Okay, well the aliens are easy to beat, but not, but I should I should still not lower my guard. <laughs> I guess I wasn't really paying attention to what I was doing. Well, I gotta finish up here quick. The Air Force is here. Okay, good. I... I finished off the city. Wait. So, this single-player segment of my recording has already gone by? Is an hour has already passed by? Wow. Ah. That <laughs> one hour has already passed by, and that's just and that's just playing by myself here. And it's like been an, an hour and a half during the, the multiplayer segment with me and my my friend and my sister. How much longer, how much longer would this game go on for? Right now it's been like two and a half hours. <laughs> wow, this is probably like one of my longest gameplays ever. Of course you, of course people wouldn't stick around to watch the game this long, would they? Yeah, I'm not expecting I'm not expecting anybody to watch the whole video through, like a movie, but, uh, you know, the reason why I'm continuing this game and going all the way to the end like this 
is because I just want to I just want to prove that I have beat the game before. I'm rapid tapping A, but it won't let me keep fluttering forward. This is that's why I'm at, this is my least favorite game. Even with a good controller, I can't do that one. Buenos Aires. <laughs> oh, are we in Peru right now? <laughs> my grandpa's homeland. <laughs> ah. Ah! I'm trying to get rid of that stupid aircraft carrier! Ah! Alright. Just give you a kick. There we go. Alright, boxing glove. Alright, put up your dudes. Oh, but why, why aren't you moving forward? Ah, move forward! Yeah, my, see, my controller is really. Controller is really crapping out here. And that's what would make this whole segment pretty difficult. Another, another reason why I say that the alien segment's a lot easier is because when the aliens are shooting you, it's so much easier to see the bullets. It's a lot easier to dodge the bullets, too. Even though these bullets don't damage you as much, you'd still want to dodge them, but at least you can, you know? <laughs> Another one of you guys, eh? Oh. Launcher alien. And get some more fruit. Remember to eat your fruits and veggies. <laughs> yeah, nobody cares anymore about anything. Which really is very sad. Oh no, that's not good. The, the Air Force is already here. And I have a couple buildings left to finish. Maybe I can do this. Ah. Okay, that that worked. Oh, and now we're going into South Africa. Remember, at one point we ended up going to Egypt. Well, depending on the background, it looks like we're already there. I hate deserts so much. Well, I, I was stuck. I'm pr practically stuck living in a desert town my entire life. I just I'm sick of them. Super punch! Oh no! No! Guess I gotta use it right now. Here. Yeah, I was never gonna make it up to the top and then punch down. Yeah, 
I'm just not given any time to use that super punch at all. Johannesburg is a desert, huh? Is it another desert region? Nairobi. That's definitely in the desert. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, what the heck? Um, oh, there you are. You're in the you're in the sewer! There you are. Some of those rocket launcher guys are in the sewer. <laughs> Which is pretty weird. If you ask me. do that what hey 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 what the I wasn't pressing any buttons yeah when I when it was doing that kick thing I wasn't pressing any buttons I was like really weird yeah see that's how bad my my bad controller is now I'm like so good at video games I intentionally used the back controller to to give my friends and my sister a chance. You know, I basically just played the games so well. <laughs> I I just used my bad controller up to a point where it's you literally can't. You know, <laughs> it's like I'm just able to. I, I'm still apparently I'm able to play the back controller just as well as anybody can with a new one. <laughs> 